shall never ever lose its power. Shall never, shall never lose, shall never lose its power. Shall never ever lose its power. Shall It's a national gathering we have at church with amazing people. So I'm traveling with um, my friends from church. And you guys will meet the guys just now. They hate the camera guys. They like legit hate the camera. So I'm gonna try and vlog it with them. We left KZN like two hours ago. Yeah guys, I'm bringing you guys along. It's gonna be an amazing weekend. You're gonna meet my amazing friends. Um, what else, Mom? Let's meet on YouTube now. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> okay, hi, I'm Spoon. This is so fun. We are going to the Young Adult Seminar and it's um, supposed to be life changing basically. The yep. topic is uh, Psalms 27 verse 4. It's going to be... We have no idea yet what... We, what we have no idea what we it's have, about, Yeah, we're going to be shook. This is the topic guys, we are going to be shook. Yeah. We're going to share those. Yeah. And the guys are coming now. They're going to hate the camera guys. Trust. <laughs> Yeah, I was going to say that to my subscribers. <laughs> so, you say that to my subscribers? <laughs> CJ, say hi. Dad's going to say hi. Thank you. That's all you needed to do. High five. High five. Thanks, Daz. You're the real G. Ready, CJ? Just to say hi. <laughs> Subscribe, tell your friends. <laughs> <laughs> so the lighting here is proper. Um, yeah guys, so I'm just catching a bite, we're gonna be on the road again. And we have like how long friend until we get to where we're going? Then, how long do we have left? How long do we have? Till we reach our destination. Oh uh, we probably like two, two hours. Two hours, yeah. Yeah. So yeah guys. Bring you guys along. Are you ready? I'm ready. Are you ready? I'm not ready, guys. I'm not ready to just yeah, be ready. shaken and be better people. Yeah. Hey, wait, don't rush. Don't rush. I would like to send a shout out to and yeah. Okay, I'd like to send a shout out to Lisa. Jesus is king and will forever be. Yes, down below. Yeah, down below. Yes. Yes. So we have Uspume with the mer. We have Utepi, Miss Tracy. We have Uchef Caesar. Kanye Lipuku. And then South Africa's favorite YouTuber, Special Lisa. Subscribe, like, comment, subscribe, guys. Hit that like button. Like, subscribe, guys. Subscribe. Don't sleep on Lisa. Come on now. Welcome to the mixing. Let's do the things, guys. Hello. Um, so as you guys can see, it's a vlog kind of vibes, yes. and I'm here with the girl. What's up? What's up? Just gonna say your name. Just on Hey, I'm Miss Tracy. Yes, I'm cool. Cool. yes. This thing is Kanye. Get it, girl. This is shit, but slender guys. Okay. This is Miss CD. <laughs> And of course, I'm just amazing, you guys. Those are my here. And you guys know me. I'm Lisa M. And um, so, 
the desert experience, guys. I'm gonna go straight into the desert. Oh my god. So, as you guys can see by the title of the video, the desert experience, you're probably like, what? What is this? So, we're gonna explain. Um, so, we just came, it's the end of the young adult seminar. Mm -hmm. um, it's the last day. We're about to leave. So people are rushing. Dude, like, people yeah. are rushing. And, people that are rushing. Are rushing. Are rushing. and you know how gents are when they wanna leave? They're they just like, yeah, they are just walking in. So, we're like, wait a minute, we're gonna do a video. It has to be done for y'all. We're doing it for you guys. Um, we just want to share with you guys what the desert experience is, what it yeah. meant to us, what we learned. Mm. How much did you guys learn? A lot. And it was a lot. I think all of us are actually renewed. Something yeah. Like, yeah. 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 There's, there's, yeah. There's a change. Yeah. There's a shift in spirits. Yeah. yeah. It is. So we fresh from the camp. We're gonna go. We're gonna share all that we can, and we're gonna go right into it. So, um, where can we start, guys? The desert experience. What is that? What What are you talking about? What's? I think we should actually start maybe with like not to go into too much detail with um yesterday. Come session. in. Sorry. Yeah, we did. We have it. What? Are we about to leave? Yeah. yeah give us twenty minutes. You said two o'clock to me. No, but the storm is coming. Okay, give us twenty minutes. Ten. Wow. See, talk about niggas wanting to be. So, Mama was always talking about the fact that women share different experiences mm -hmm. yeah. and how we face deserts mm -hmm. and how we can't pull each other down when you already see what your sister's going through the most. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we need to and women love each other. that yeah. these days. It's, it's, it's basically taking like life experiences, like what we go through every day, and mm. just and it's literally like a desert. We mm. go through times where we feel like we are so alone. We yeah. we cannot yeah. see anything that can help us, yeah. Yeah. and we just need to understand the fact that we go through it. We don't live there. We don't stay there yeah. forever. We are going mm -hmm. through. We're trying our video. Hey guys, just saying goodbye, yeah? Uh, so basically, I feel like we all face, face different deserts. You could be going through something that she obviously doesn't understand, that's a desert to you. Yeah. You're going through something yeah. that she doesn't understand, that's a desert to you. Mm. But most importantly, it's just one of those things that help you equip you differently in your different deserts. Yeah. And I think the What's desert it? experience is also a place where you're waiting to hear from God. Yeah. Like yeah. Like yeah. He's, he's answering you. Mm. But he's not answering you now, yeah. and you're there and you're waiting. You're thinking, but in this barren land, in mm. this empty place, mm. where are you, God? I think we all our deserts are different, mm. but it's a place where you're barren from answers from the God. That's that exactly. is and, and it's also, it's also about how well, your attitude while you're waiting. While you're waiting. Because but, I think yeah. for most of us, it's it's very hard to wait for God yeah. to yeah. throw that blessing onto you and be like, yeah. okay, because we're always stuff. expecting things to happen right yeah. now. Yeah. Yeah. But can the desert also be where God says no? Yeah. yeah. That's yeah. also yeah. because I'm not gonna give you. Yeah. I'm not gonna give you the water, but only because He's bringing you something else that you're not expecting. Another mm. thing that can be a desert is you have this idea in your mind. You know exactly where you want to be, mm. but yeah. you're just not getting there. And because yeah. that, that waiting, that that block there between mm. what I see and where that I am might now, be the period. That is that is that sometimes for a lot of people is a desert. And how do you deal with that? Because you know you're going there. And yeah. my mom was all saying, "Was well, he God's plans for you?" Are not the same plans that you have. Yeah, your thoughts are not God's thoughts. Exactly. Yeah. So it's a situation where when he comes through and he gives you everything that he had planned for you, mm. you can't look at it as, a, as if it's a disappointment because he knows better for you than yeah. you know yeah. for yourself. Exactly. It's in Jeremiah, isn't it? Mm. Yeah. Jeremiah 11. Yeah. Sometimes I, I feel as though God will put you through the desert experience because he wants you to first learn something. Yeah. Because mm. you're in such a rush to get there that you're not really getting the point. Fine, we're, we're in this desert, we understand what it is, yeah. but what have we learned as coping mechanisms? Yeah. 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 Desert, desert. I think for me the one thing I learned <coughs> is just to have faith above all else. Yeah. You know that scripture that he read in Habakkuk 3, yeah. the last one, yeah. when he's like, whether the fig tree does not bud, whether there are no cows in the yeah. store, yeah. I will continue to serve the Lord. I was yeah. just like, yeah. Yeah. even when I don't have what yeah. I want, yeah. I will continue to serve God. Yeah. Yeah. What do you say, Sophie? And I, I say the desert is a place where God puts you in a situation where even when he says no, you need to fight your way out. And to endure, guys, the whole yeah. endurance. Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes yes. you have to just stick, Definitely. like, just, what's the, what's the word? Persevere. 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 Just remember that you're not alone. Everybody exactly. goes through yeah. something. A lot of times people are going through the exact same thing as usually mm. people don't share. Yeah. People don't, it's, yeah. it's, it's important to communicate. If you need someone to talk to, just comment there and we're going to help you. And I can hear that. Another thing I can add, what you could add, is that every single question that you want and the answers in the Bible, <laughs> that word is better than that. It's a little bit of 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 a little
for me guys i think also another important thing is to identify yourself as a person in god when you identify yourself and you know your purpose and your values you know exactly what you need to do so once you know who you are and your value in god yeah. then you know exactly yeah. how to get away yeah. and get out of that desert experience but guys don't forget come and like and subscribe to this beautiful Hello. Hello. And if you didn't catch the memo, you need to catch us again next time. Same time, same place. Yeah. About six o'clock. DJ. So we're on our way home. Hometown. Hometown. Very sad, but it was amazing. 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 Well, we're we're people haven't been sleeping the whole weekend. Guys, we slept a total maybe of about six hours in oh, traveling oh, here. Six hours. That's just total. Yeah, we're going home. So yeah, guys, thank you for watching. Oh. So say bye. So say bye to the people.